there's nothing better than sharing a beer with friends. Except maybe sharing a brewery with friends. And the Boundary Brewery is doing exactly that. Sure, telling your friends that you're hanging out at a co-op craft brewery in Belfast might get you branded as a hipster by some. But the excellent beer and laid-back atmosphere of Boundary makes it worth swallowing that dubious distinction. The co-op model of the brewery means that the people there are really invested in what they do. And it's not just the members who are enjoying Boundary's offerings. They've received the distinction of Best Beer in Northern Ireland from some online publications, as well as Best Brewer and Best New Brewery. And the Boundary of Boundary continues to grow. Their distribution has extended as far as London. So we started three years ago. Um, our two co-founders are Matthew Dick, who is our head brewer, and Matthew Scrimgar. Um, Matt Dick went to the States, discovered a whole new world of good beer, came back here and kind of knew that he wanted to open a brewery. So he was introduced to Matt Scrimgar, he introduced him to the cooperative model. Um, right. It meant as a business, what it meant for him, what it meant for members, and what it meant to the people who would be buying the beers. Right. Um, but yeah, we, we like big, kind of punchy American IPAs. Uh, Belgian style beers, saisons, stubbles, quads, all that kind of thing. Um, we've made about 170 different beers. Wow. Last so you guys beers. keep them rotating pretty frequently? Yeah. yeah. So we have, we have four core beers that we make all year round, nice. and then the rest we kind of change. Nice. Uh, I don't think I've ever been in a brewery that feels as much like an art studio as I have here. Yeah. So. The labels are individually commissioned <laughs> paintings from an artist called John Robinson. Uh, John and Matthew had known each other for a couple of years. A story got out last year that I was having at a restaurant in Belfast uh -huh. that uh, John was blind and we brought him in, plied him with beer and he came the canvas. <laughs> and we actually brewed a beer a couple of months ago called Blind Artist to kind of celebrate that urban myth. Um, but John's not blind and we don't kidnap him. Right. He's always up for free 